It has been a tough week for the Vandals community. Alec Halem died on January 17, 2021. He was just 22 years old. He'll always be remembered for his strong work ethic and his love for Idaho women's basketball. We were all just heartbroken. Like it just was so sudden. It's, it's tough to hear about anyone, but especially someone, you know, as sweet as him. Those who knew Alec Halem say that he was the best student manager you could have. He was hardworking never missed a step and kind hearted. He was just, he was so dependable, uh, you know, and he came in and he knew what his job was and he would come and do it and, and he would do whatever it took. He was awesome. I mean, there's so many great things that I could say about him and his character, you know, he was selfless. He worked so hard at his job. He showed up on time. He was always there for practice. His hard work defined in how he brought it at practice. He'd often rebound for former Vandal Taylor Pierce. We've joked about this before. He's he's the best rebounder you can find. His energy is unmatched, and the way he'd run after a miss was just like you can't you don't find that anywhere. I didn't even rebound that hard for some of my teammates during shooting drills, and he that's the kind of effort that he put in into everything he did. His kindness shown in the extra effort he'd put in for the team. You know, it would bring us pumpkin bread, banana bread, and you'd just be like, hey, you know, I made this for you guys. Um, you know, um, just carrying like the ball rack to, from the gym, like through the snow and just it was like, no, I don't need any help. I got this guy. Don't worry. Losing someone who was that great of a person is why this team took it hard. You know, just going to practice and seeing the empty uh, spot. Um, where he'd run the clock, you know, it's, uh, it's been a tough couple of days going to practice without him being there. Alec cared so much for Idaho women's basketball. This team cared so much for him. And that's why this season, they'll play for Alec. I think, you know, we're still going to focus and play as best as we can because I know that's, we know that's what Alec would want us to do. Like, he loves seeing us be successful and work hard, um, you know, so yeah, we're just going to play for him and try to do the best that we can. The Vandals are going to wear black patches on their jerseys for the rest of the season to honor Alec. And then before their next home game on February 6th against Eastern Washington, they'll have a moment of silence. Their next game is on January 28th on the road against Weber State. That's all for sports.